Okay, so what do you need to remember here? Is when we doing conjugate, we only change the sign for imaginary part only. So don't do for the real part. Imaginary part only. And then what is the relationship between complex number and its conjugate? Okay, so we want to show here. So complex number come with the situation A plus BI. Then this is our complex number. When it time with its conjugate, Z star, conjugate will be A minus VI. So what can we get here? We will expand like usual. A times A, we get A square. Then A times negative BI, we get negative ABI. And then B times A, we get positive ABI. And then B times negative B, we get negative B, and then I with I, I square. So I square, just now I square, I ask you to remember, I square, we can get to negative 1, correct? Negative 1 here. I square, always remember I square, we get to negative 1. So therefore, Negative ABI, positive ABI cancel each other. And then we go for negative BI square. We become negative B square, negative 1. Because B times B, negative B square, I times I, I square. So here we get to A square plus B square. So this is the special for complex number and its conjugate so when complex number time with its conjugate it get back a square and b square it's a real number it get back a real number you don't have any imaginary part because imaginary part i square already represent by negative one this is the special relationship between complex number and its conjugate Okay. Okay, we go for some operation. Okay, we we, we re revise some operation how to do addition, how to do plus complex number plus another complex number. One complex number plus with one complex number, how we operate it? We will take the real with real, imagine with imagine. So 3 plus 4, real number with real number, which is 7. And then imaginary part, 2i minus 5i will get negative 3i, 2 minus 5, so negative 3i. So if you have a subtraction, same also, real Real number with real number, imaginary part with imaginary part. But first of all, you expand first. It will be 5 negative 3i minus 4 plus 5i because negative negative become positive. So real number with real number, you get 1. Imaginary if imaginary negative 3 plus 5. So it will become positive 2i. So this is how we do add addition plus and subtraction minus if multiplication, you have to be careful. If it is not complex number and conjugate, we have to. If it is complex number and it's conjugate, we can straight directly go for this part. If it is not, then we have to expand one by one. So for this case, this complex number and this complex number, they they are not they are not conjugate. They are different complex number. So how are we going to do multiplication? We expand one by one. So 1 times 4, we get 4. 1 times negative i, we get negative i. Continue. Negative 3 times 4, negative 12i. 
then negative 3 go for the back, negative, negative become positive 3 i square. Okay, so put your i square first because it can become a number. So at the same time, you can see negative i, negative 12 i here will give us up to negative 13 i. And then plus i square, i square is negative 1. So now we operate the layer part. 4 minus 3 will get 1. Okay. So you can try doing this. I give you some time. You try doing this. Okay. 